Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we will discuss about a very common error that we see in Google search engine is that uh, crawled but currently not indexed. So what does it mean? It means is that uh, whatever pages is coming under that category, Google is not going to index them. So they have visited your page and they did not find the page worth enough to be indexed or it may happen that uh, previously those particular pages were indexed but uh, down the line Google has decided to de-index those pages and uh, put those pages in that category. So few months back I have also started uh, seeing lot of pages which were under that category. Now let me go to my search console and you'll have to go to coverage and uh, here you will be able to see that figures. So currently you can see around uh, 6360 pages are in excluded state and if you'll go a little bit down all those excluded pages are under the category crawled currently not indexed. So I have found few steps and it started decreasing and uh, if you will see these graphs one of the graphs you will be seeing that uh, it is uh, the excluded uh, number of pages were around 7000 and after I performed uh, those steps it started decreasing and it's not only decreasing every week I am seeing the number is decreasing so whatever steps I have done to resolve this I will share this in this video so basically I have performed three to four steps and then I started seeing this result so all the steps in order I will tell you maybe one of those steps will help you to reduce these number now let's start so first thing what I did is that I actually changed my hosting now my hosting was good but uh, as you can see I have a lot of pages in valid state so traffic started coming and uh, I was getting a lot of emails from my hosting providers that uh, upgrade your uh, hosting because your website is out of resources so I changed the hosting to a better hosting provider now what hosting I change it doesn't matter actually but still I will give the link in the description you can uh, check that hosting provider and if you feel that it is uh, better for you then you can uh, switch to that uh, hosting and if you are a new webmaster and if you are creating a new website also then also I recommend that particular web hosting the hosting is very good I have been using that for more than uh, three years I haven't got any complaint about that that's why I am recommending to you as well check the description for the link now second thing what I did is that in this page only coverage if you will go a little bit down you will be able to see many status here you will have to solve these errors so yes you can see I have three pages under this error and all of them were showing 500 error now 500 error is basically tells you that there is something wrong in your programming or there is something wrong in the server side so that you will have to figure it out and you will have to solve in my case it was a bug in the code so I have developed this website in uh, Django Python if you are aware of it so I modified few lines of coding and uh, most of the issue was resolved and as you can see the validation is started so it doesn't mean that uh, you immediately solve the issue and uh, immediately this validation will start and it will you will see the result here so for this particular section it may take months also so don't worry just resolve this issue and that's it these error will go away maybe after one week or maybe after one month also the main thing is that just resolve this error now the third thing that I did is that I have resolved the error that says 404 404 means you had that page at some point of time and Google was able to find that page but for some reason if you have deleted that then Google has still that information and it's trying to visit that page and it's not there that's why it's showing 404 error now what are those pages if you will click this then you will be able to see all the pages that is showing 404 error now basically the good way to resolve 
this issue is that create those uh, page again or uh, implement a redirection method with 301 status code now if you are using wordpress then uh, lots of plugins are there you can simply install them and automatically all 404 errors will be redirected now if you want a video on that particular part then definitely give your comment in the comment section and i will try to make a video on that and uh, if you are using any other programming language or any other website builder then definitely there must be some mechanism to implement redirection method for those pages the next thing what i did actually is that i updated all the pages now if you will click this option crawl currently not indexed then you will be able to see all the pages below which are basically crawled but not indexed so what i did is that i started updating those pages there are a lot of pages here as you can see so what i did is that i wrote a script so that script basically gave me whichever pages was not updated for two months and uh, again i wrote one more script to update those so i have uh, developed this uh, website in programming language so that's why i had to write a script now if you have wordpress then definitely you will have to go to that particular page and you have to modify that and uh, this was the last step i did along with the previous steps and uh, the moment i started uh, modifying after one week i started seeing the degrees in these accounts so basically whatever were not indexed they were now indexed only and the number started decreasing now which steps basically worked it basically hard to tell because uh, nowhere you will find a clear cut method to resolve this issue it's basically comes with uh, the approach hit and trial method so all the steps that i did to resolve this i have shared with you so you can start implementing those steps and see which one is working for you and uh, if you have faced this kind of issue and if you are going to implement these methods then uh, and if it is working then definitely let me know in the comment section and uh, if you have done something else which has resolved this issue then also please tell me those things in the comment section so that everybody will be aware of it that's all for this video if you have any additional question then uh, give your feedback on the comment section don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon so that whatever new video i upload in my channel you will get a notification immediately